Hey everybody, quick little video. Uh, I don't think you can see it down there. See a little orange spot down the bottom down yonder? That's a, uh, a closed detergent container. And hunt season's coming up. I'm going to use my Winchester 3030 this year to hunt with out of the blind. Okay, so I've invited you out here with me to the farm today to, uh, well, to see if I can't hit something with this thing. Y'all hold on. All right, everybody, as I said, I am Cold Steel Bill. This is my Winchester Model 94. And uh, like I said, hunting season's coming up, so I brought it out today, run a few rounds through it, and I got that jug down there set up, and uh, I'm just going to try to hit it. Y'all wish me luck. Old lead through here. This is typically a simulated blind shot. Might actually be a little bit low. It took me three shots to get it, but I got it on the third shot, and uh, things about 13, 14 inches wide and about 16 inches tall. And me being blind as a bat, I got floaters. That's the biggest problem: is floaters and astigmatism. But either way, there you go. I think I'm. I may shoot it some more, but I'm gonna get closer to my target, see exactly where I'm hitting. May take it in. Oh. Yeah, may take it in and tap the sights a little bit, depending on how I'm shooting with it. I typically shoot a little to the left, and probably what I'm doing. So, either way, there you go. Winchester Model 94, and I think this one was made in 1968. Uh, so, it's not one of the older ones. It's one of the probably lesser valued ones. But um, I've taken it apart and put it back together a couple of times. Let me tell you what, <laughs> it comes apart and goes back together a hell of a lot better than that Mossberg did. Oh, my God. <sighs> All right, everybody, that's it. Cold Steel Bill here coming to you from out at the farm. Okay, and like I said, we were shooting down yonder at the targets. Tell you what, let's go down there and see what we did. 
All right, well, the ping's still a couple times good. Yeah, about 30-30. That's some tough stuff. And I smell pine, like broken, fresh cut pine. Yeah, let's see where I hit this jug at. Oh, there it is. That's what I'm smelling. I hit low. Or Huh. I don't think I actually hit the jug at all. I was low with the shot. It was up here like it was up here like this. So the bullet oops, I'm sorry guys. It was up here like this, and there's that split in the bottom of it. So I don't know where the bullet went in at. Surely that's not it, or is it? Is that it? Well, maybe it is. I'll be done. Evidently, the bullet went in right there. And it just shredded all this back here. Like I said, when I, when I came down, I was smelling fresh pine. And it's that lighter. Well, I'm shooting a little bit low. About six inches low. I counted off 163 steps down here from the truck. So, probably about 160, 159 yards. Anyway, that's it, guys and gals, boys and girls, and I want to talk to you later. Thank you for joining me here on the Bob Gnarly 69 channel. I am Cold Steel Bill. Again, thank you for joining me. Adios, mi amigos. Au revoir. Bye.